Dude, I've been fully waiting to break this thing out. She's a beaut. I actually like it. Yeah. It's turd brown, but it's fantastic. Check how the motor is just crammed in here. This is the engine that your 61 actually maybe needs. 500 inches of Cadillac power. Bigger is better. All we gotta do is move the nitrous bottle, put it in the passenger seat, and we can go. Yep, I'm gonna hop in. Let's do burnouts before we even put the seat in. Man, I've never even sat in this thing. Oh, wow. It's actually really good. I bought this thing at a low buck drag race that we had here in Tucson way back in January 2018. So it's been sitting here like 11 months. It's a 1973 AMC Gremlin, but the guy stuffed it with a 500 cubic inch Cadillac engine. That would be the engine that was in like a 1970 to 72 CAD, same engine family as a 472. And it has a turbo 400 in it. I don't remember what it has for a rear end. Oh, I think it has a Mopar 8 and 3 quarter. I'll have to look. But it's hopped up a little bit. It's got a cam and stuff, intake manifold, holly, and of course, nitrous. They told me that they once had to throw this car off the track here in Tucson because it went 1080 with no roll bar. And so I had a roll bar put in it while it was sitting here, but I've never driven the thing. And unfortunately, we're not gonna be able to drag race it here in this episode because we gave the track no notice whatsoever that we were gonna be here. But we are gonna be able to go thrash it around, do burnouts, check it out, get to know it, and break it to make it our own. Ready to start this thing? Wow. Sweet. This sounds good. Sounds pretty good. This might be more reliable than the other car. This thing runs better than anything we own. Yeah, it really does. Yeah. Burnouts? Burnouts. not have power steering. That's not very Cadillac-ish. You know, we've been wanting to build the Hemi Gremmy forever. This is the Caddy Gremmy. Be able to find out how much I love Gremmys. The slicks are a little flat on one side from sitting for a long time. Bump, 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 bump. Spunky. Oh man, this thing is gonna be good. He's got the front end set up loose. It transfers a lot. Yeah. Uh -oh. Wait, 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 stop. Stop. Come back. Kill it. What happened? You don't have a water pump anymore. Belt flew off? Yeah. Went to 5,000 RPM, hit the rev limiter. That was fun. It was just stupid, but it's fun. You might get one more burnout out of that. Yeah, that's hashed. But we can get one more burnout out of it. There's no parts stores open right now, right? I think it's gonna work. Okay, let's try this again. Hopefully it runs. This time I'm gonna try and keep it off 5,000 RPM and keep the belt on it. Yeah! Ah, it started. Okay, fuel pump, fan. <laughs> hey dude, it's like bunny hopping to the left. <laughs> Do it again. That was great. Oh! Uh, it wants to do distance instead of brake stamp. It kind of hooks up and bounces. It's so fun. That was it. I'm actually a little disappointed. Maybe I should drive. The fan belt's still on, yeah! It's still there, but only halfway. It's actually twisted right now. <laughs> that just got belted. That was pretty good. <laughs> It still hops, it does not like that. And I'm destroying these slicks, but we don't care. Uh, this time on roadkill, idiocrity at its finest. That was pretty good. I actually thought it wasn't. Why? Yeah, just not enough fury, not enough RPM. It was just... It's a Cadillac, it's what they do. Really? Yes. Oh, man. It's done at 4,500. We need to Absolutely fix that. over. Yeah.
Look at the distance. I mean, the distance was good. It just it didn't have the fury. It didn't have the fire. Let's make it shoot fire. No. Well, can we do that? No? Okay. <laughs> Let's fix it. The belts just keep flying off this thing, and part of it is that that belt was completely hashed. But also, I think that's just going to happen because the pulley alignment is horrible. The water pump pulley is way further forward than the crank pulley, and the alternator pulley is... So I'm going to work on fixing that. All right. I love the Gremlin. Not a big fan of the 500 CAD, though. It revs just a little too low for my liking, but whatever, not my car. I do want to ride in it, though, so that 10-pound bottle of NOS, that's got to move. I'm going to bolt this random bucket in, one seat belt, and then donuts and wheelies, I hope. Probably runs 10s, too. I got the lower pulley off, and what's interesting, these CAD 500s often do not have a harmonic balancer on them at all. There's just like a stub there on the crank and this bolts right to it and there's no damper. So I need to space the pulley out. What I'm gonna do is tape some washers behind these holes to try and keep them from falling and driving me insane as I install it. And then that's gonna move that thing forward by that amount, which is gonna be perfect for belt alignment. Ready? Yeah. Fan belt on, battery charge, passenger seat in. All right. This is hot rodding. Stuff yeah. the biggest engine you can afford into the smallest car, damn safety, and go have fun. More burnouts and go home? Yeah. Ha 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 ha!